Hello, this is Donna. It's December 28th. About to go shopping. I'm here visiting mom in Dallas. Um, beautiful day. It's mid 60s and sunny, and um, it's like the day after the day after Christmas. So, gonna go to the mall, gonna have some, gonna go to Costco. Got my friend Jamie and I are just gonna do some shopping. So, thought we'd uh, bring you along with us. This is Donna. I'm in the parking lot over at the mall. Um, and it's sunny. See, look above here. It's a sunny, beautiful sunny day. We're going in the mall. We just went to Costco. Had a great time. You know how I feel about Costco. So, anyways, we're going into the mall. Um, it doesn't seem like it's too busy. Does it? Nope. Nope. I'll move, move, move. Say hello. Hello. It is very bright. It is very bright. It is very bright. We're going to the mall. Bye. So we went shopping. We spent some money. We did good, huh? We did very good. We did good. Yes. Let's see. Yes. Yeah. Oh, good sales. And the mall's a lot of fun today. There's lots, of, lots of color, lots of people. It's not too crazy, you know. But that's just the way it goes. So let's just walk. See, this is, see how fun this is? See, I could turn around and around. I could make people like, oh, la, 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 la. Anyways, but see. Oh. Shopping with Donna. It's an experience to never forget, I promise you. Right? That's true. <laughs> Have fun. So this is the Mac store. See, this is the Mac store. The Mac store makeup. It's like a playground for me. It's like a playground. When I was just starting out, I um, I shopped at Mac. And I used to go there, I was scared to death. And there was a guy who helped me. He was he had he wore more makeup than I did, but he was just so accepting and so uh, helpful and just made me feel good. So I've been a Mac uh, I've been a Mac shopper ever since. They've earned my they've earned my business and so I love to go to the Mac store. I buy stuff, I don't even know how to use it. But I try. I do the best. I'm still a beginner with this stuff, you know? It's just the way it goes. I'm still just pretty much a beginner. I try though. What are you gonna do? See? It's just so cool. It's the Mac store. It's the Mac store. I love the Mac store. There's the tree. It's a, it's a big. That's a big tree. There's another store that's like candy store right down there. See that? That's what I'm talking. About. But not too crazy out here today. Just a nice day shopping in Arlington, Texas. The day after the day after the day after Christmas. get quite a hunger going with this kind of stuff don't you think I'm not I can't eat that I gotta fit in my clothes but it looks good we could have pretzels pretzels so now we're outside of Victoria's Secret and it's so funny to watch the men who go in with my my son wouldn't be caught dead within 20 yards of this store for nothing but the men want their girlfriends to buy stuff, but they feel they look so uncomfortable inside. It's just hilarious to me. So, can't see any men in there. But they're there, don't worry about it. They love when we wear the stuff that comes from there, don't you think? Anyways, Victoria's Secret, another place that I've gone since the beginning. I did my first bra fitting there. They did a good job. And so, again, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a customer. It's crazy how this thing works. So this is Coach. There. It's Coach. So, when I first started transitioning, I had a friend and she said, you know you finally come to your own when you get your first Coach bag. And I had no idea. I had never heard of Coach. You know, most of my 
Buffaloes had Buffalo Bills insignias on it and sports teams and stuff. They didn't do stuff like coach. When they said coach, I thought they were talking sports, but no, not really. They're talking leather. So I finally got my first coach. I know I'd arrived when I got my first coach bag. So I know what it finally means now. Coach. This is shopping. We're, we're walking down. Just This is how it looks. This is what it's like to go shopping in the mall with us, right? We're just walking, minding our own business. <laughs> See, I feel like Survivor Man. This thing is so cool. I mean, we could just play all day long. Shopping is fun. Shopping is like a social adventure. It's an experience. Even if you don't buy stuff, trying stuff on and looking at stuff and saving money. I mean, all those things are just fun things. I think they're fun things. And people watching. Oh my god, there are some people here having a blast. When, it's nice to go to places where you're not the most interesting thing to watch. So, at least I don't think we are. Anyways, uh, shopping the day that after the day after the day after Christmas. We're going for pretzels. Did I mention we're going for pretzels? So we're shopping. This is shoes, see? These are large shoes. Lots of us. We have fairly large feet. So we have kind of unique feet needs. So all of the cute shoes, they don't look so cute when they're a size 11 or size 12 or size 13 or size 14. But um, anyway, so we shop at places where we can get larger shoes to fit our larger feet. So I'm a creature of comfort. Um, so I try to get shoes that are fairly comfortable. I don't understand why those of us who are already tall need to buy heels to get even taller. But it looks good, but realistically not so comfortable. Anyways, shoe shopping the day after the day after the day after Christmas. Now, do you see a cute shoe anywhere in this rack? Do you see a cute, do you see anything cute? I see sneakers. Do you see anything? Maybe Lots of sneakers. The cute shoes. Cute shoes are size six. Sorry, that's just the way it is. Going up the escalator. Going up, 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 up in the world. Gotta get some friends on this. So we, we have arrived at the mother load of pretzels, which is Auntie Anne's. Auntie Anne's. Back when I was younger, there was only one of them in Rochester. There's one mall. We used to go all the way across town just to that mall, just to get those pretzels. I know there's other pretzels out there, and Auntie Anne is not paying me for advertising. But these pretzels rock. I mean, they just do. My son called me up. I was shopping with Christmas Eve Eve and asked me to bring home Auntie Anne's pretzels for dinner. We eat well at my house. You know, I'm a good mom. I make sure that my son is properly sustenance with the five food groups, two of which are pretzels and dip, mustard. So Auntie Anne's, we're having we're having a break for food. 